first and foremost, thanks for inviting me over. Uh, I'm really happy to be here. My name is Nash Maris. Uh, I'm a senior electrical engineer with Morrison Hirschfield. Morrison Hirschfield is a multidisciplinary engineering company. I am an early adopter uh, of technology. I was really excited to be one of the you know forerunners of uh, being uh, AP uh, certified and you know trying to bring the wide score more on the Canadian level here. I'm really excited where wide score is going into the future with some of the foundational work that has already been done. Uh, and I and like I said, I'm an early adopter. So you know, getting that uh, foundation set. So whenever those certifications or you know those new realms come in, I'll be more than excited to you know lead wide score, lead my clients into that. With wide score, I use that infrastructure information from my design experience to like provide a whole holistic approach to clients about you know having a resilient infrastructure. And then when smart score comes in, different different systems you make them holistic again, talk to each other. You know, the end clients or the owners or the occupants, and they want to see a little more of digital infrastructure in the building. How can we like promote that? So many of the times we like provide feasibility studies during, you know, early programming days and stuff, just to see if there are spaces where, you know, we can make it resilient enough. Why score has given me the clarity that I need to put, give to give that design information to the clients. And I'm really happy with that kind of, uh, you know, the support that I get from ISCO, not only passively, but also I know tomorrow I can always pick the phone up, talk to Andrew and say, hey, Andrew, I have this project, get asking for some score information. So the advice I would give for anybody who is pursuing a score smart score accreditation is just go for it. You have to be passionate about these things, uh, especially knowing where technology is today and where it's going to be in the future. And I would say, you know, this is the right time to get into wide score and smart score. Teach yourself, uh, educate yourself, educate clients. Uh, they'll be more than happy that you did that, uh, passed over that information. So the Toronto real estate industry right now is sweating. Whether it's residential real estate or commercial real estate, it's been a crazy ride. Uh, there's a lot of challenges, especially with uh, interest rates. Uh, so getting the right amount of funding, the capital investments, Investors are looking at uh, projects where they can, you know, where there's a promise of tech funding, you know, if this prop, prop tech comes in and stuff like that. With smart spaces, uh, smart buildings, uh, there, there's just a lot more to happen because as more real estate comes, there's a lot of fight that's going to happen for utilizing that space. Um, today with hybrid environments and uh, work from home environments, like real estate entities are finding it hard to get people back. Having a holistic approach to your building design uh, makes it a rather good selling point for you know not only the prolifer proliferation of technology but also getting users back into the buildings.